Here we want to do something very important, which is adding fractions, something that comes up a lot. 2 divided by 9 plus 3 divided by 6. So it's not too difficult, but we need to be careful so that we have the same common denominator here. It's not the same, so we need to figure out what that's going to be. And hopefully it's the lowest common denominator, such that our problem is as easy as possible. So to find out what the lowest common denominator is, we need to factorize the 9 and the 6 and then see what that factor is going to be. So if we factorize a 9, we can say the factors of 9 are 3 and 3, and the factors of 6 are 2 and 3. So we can see that the common factor here, or the lowest common factor, is going to be 3 times 2 times 3, so that's 18. So 3 times 3 is 9, and then we have this term here, 2, so that's 18. So if we, in other words, replace this with 18 and this with 18 somehow, then we can add them together. So to get this to 18, we need to do something to the numerator and the denominator. To get this to 18, we need to do something to the numerator and the denominator. So what do we need to get this to 18? We need to multiply this by 2. To get this to 18, we need to multiply this by 3. So we'll multiply 2 over 2 here, and we'll multiply this by 3 over 3 here. So that doesn't change anything. We're only multiplying by 1 after all. 2 over 2 is 1, and 3 over 3 is 1. But now we'll multiply it out, see what we get, and we'll probably have a, a common denominator. So 2 times 2 gives us 4, and then 2 times 9 gives us 18. So of course that's what we were going for originally. And then we were at this. 3 times 3 is 9, and 6 times 3 is 18. Great, so we have common denominators, we can add them up, and then we'll be almost done. 4 plus 9 gives us 13, and then we have the common denominator of 18, and at this point we stop and think about whether or not we can reduce it any further. We've combined the fraction to a single term, but we want to see can we reduce this any further. We can't reduce this any further, there are no common factors between the 13 and the 18, so we're done. The answer is just 13 over 18.